Hello, people. This is Loud and Styles, and I'm being joined by Supersonic 407. Hey, yo, what's up? Okay, um, you know, I said I wasn't going to even be part of this. This whole little thing that just some random geek and a few other people are getting themselves into about um, Joshua 8428 and Ariana or Cheyenne Forever 1. But after looking at all of this stuff that's been going on, I, I just have to say the following. Well, well don't do you really want to say it first, Supersonic? All right, sure. Um, okay, how do I put this? Um, oh, boy. Just looking at this situation that's been going on with people like Joshua A428, Shiana Forever, um, who else? Uh, the Dread Dormammu, and all because Shiana Forever got overly sensitive because Joshua said, Aelin, who likes My Little Pony, is stupid, and yet Shiana Forever gets overly sensitive about it. Well, how do I say this? This is just... Fucking stupid. I'm sorry. It's that ridiculous. It actually is. It is really stupid. I mean, you don't see anybody else getting that upset because somebody doesn't like what they like. I like Adventure Time, but you don't see me get, getting all all up in a huff in my underwear in a bunch because somebody doesn't like Adventure Time. I mean, I hate to say it, but, you know, Joshua... I still think you're a faggot, but still, um, if your friendship with Ariana basically got, you know, destroyed because you thought that, well, pff, that's no one's fault. You didn't do anything. You stated you stated something that you don't like, and you think that anybody that watched My Little Pony is stupid. Okay, if she was too overly insensitive about that, oh well, you can find other friends. Don't let the door hit her ass on the way out. Yeah, it's just really sad that. Like Joshua, uh, out of all out of all these people, he just says his opinion. Like, okay, I, I, oh, I don't find. How do I say it? I don't find My Little Pony entertaining. I, 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 uh, I find it kind of stupid. And, Basically, and, yeah, and and he pretty said, okay, yeah, anyone who doesn't like My Little Pony is stupid. And then this happens. We get all we get all this drama starting from Shiana Forever, and then all this happens. Like with the, from the very moment that Joshua made that video, said, "You ruined me, YouTube. You are tearing me apart, YouTube." <laughs> that's basically what's happening. And and, that, and then that's you know everyone got on it with one shot commentary saying, "Oh, it's your fault. You're the one who said you're the one who said anyone thinks My Little Pony is stupid." But when you really get down to it. I, it I is kind of stupid. Yeah, I, mean, I can't believe I'm saying this, but Joshua was just stating his opinion. I'm sorry if I'm sounding if I'm defending the guy, but think about it. He was just stating his opinion about a freaking show. My Little Pony, of all things. And then all this drama went on. And all these one-shots get on him. Even Jen Otaku, one, two, three of people. I mean, and, really? Uh, really? It was ridiculous. <laughs> I mean, when I first heard about it, I was like, okay, it's some more Joshua drama. I really didn't pay attention to it. I was like, I ain't even going to be in this shit. But then the more I start thinking about it and I start hearing it, I was like, this is the stupidest shit I've ever heard. Like, who in the fuck would get oversensitive because somebody said My Little Pony was stupid? You're 19 years old, first of all. I mean... I know age shouldn't be brought up, but you're 19 years old and you got overly sensitive because somebody said My Little Pony was stupid. Yeah, I mean, I mean, it's kind of, I mean, here's another example. It's kind of like me. I like Yu-Gi-Oh. I use Yami Merrick as my avatar because of that. Some people just come up to me and say, "Hey, you're a goddamn weeaboo," and yet you don't see me getting overly sensitive because I use goddamn Yami Merrick of all characters as my goddamn avatar. You I, may not get overly offended, but the millions of people that did a commentary on Jim eighty one Jim probably did. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man. Oh, uh, I think that's just all we wanted to say because I was, I was just talking to, I was just talking to Supersonic, and I was like, okay, am I the only one who just thinks that this is just really retarded? Am I the only one who thinks this? 
And luckily, I was I wasn't the only one. Yeah, I, yeah, because I I kind of okay, I didn't really get into this whole situation thing, but then I remembered. Um, I think it was the other day. I was in a I, hold on, what was it? Okay, yeah, I was in a Skype call with with like Dredge Ramamu, so a few other people, and I of course call, just which... some random geek. And from what the Dredge Ramamu told me. Just, just some random geek. He was going to defend Joshua, and to be perfectly honest, this is just my opinion here, but I wouldn't blame just some random geek because again, this is just so stupid. It is. It really is. And what's funny is like I get other people asking me stuff about geek, and I'm like, well, I told them, I just told them all the stuff I know about him because I'm friends with geek and all that, and it's like. <laughs> I hear Jen Otaku saying, like, oh, I, Geek is such a jerk and an idiot and all that. And I'm like, okay, I'm not even really saying anything, but I'm like, how can you call some – how can you say Geek's an idiot when, in fact, he just stated something that's so obvious that it hurts? Guys, I, that's, I, we just wanted to do that. We just wanted to respond because I was just like, hey, Supersonic, do you feel like how I feel about this whole situation? He's like, well, yes, I do. Like, cool, let's do a rant together because people just need to know this. And that's exactly what happened, because I know a lot of you are going to be asking, how did you two come up with this? And you got your answer in this video, so I think that's about it, don't you think, man? Because we're just rambling like hell. Yeah, yeah, we're just rambling on and on, repeating ourselves. Nobody wants to hear that shit. Nobody wants to hear that. Exactly, we're trying to distance ourselves from the other sucky third-gen commentators. Um... <laughs> anyway... Uh Anyway, guys, that's Supersonic 407. I'm Loudon Styles, here to tell you that a daily dose of awesome sauce will make Captain Planet go away. Good night. Laters.